Hi friends, it's just Aislinn for our weekly update. And this week I wanted to tell you a little bit about what I have coming up. I'm looking forward to dropping downtown on Wednesday and I'll be able to meet you guys anywhere downtown. If you're interested in finding out what I'm gonna have available on my Aislinn's Overflow of Abundance farm stand pre-order, just go ahead and click the link below. It's just a simple Facebook group and I send out an order form where you then can choose what I have available. And I'll be available for picking those things up late in the afternoon on Wednesday. Okay, that's one thing coming up. And then of course, this Saturday, October the 23rd, I am going out to the Canali Dairy and they're gonna be doing their fall festival. I'm gonna have all my farm goodies all set up, a nice farm stand with all my fresh produce and lots of dried salts and all of my other fermented goodies as well. I will have all that stuff at the Canali Farm from 3 to 7 p.m. on October the 23rd, that's Saturday. I hope you guys will come out to not only get some goodies from me and all the other awesome local vendors, but also to check out the amazing dairy to get some of their great products and to definitely check out their beautiful baby cows. Okay, don't also forget that October the 29th and 30th, we'll be doing our Roundup Corpus Christi. We've moved to the farm moving sale, and we hope that you'll come out and check us out, check what we have available, and see if there's any goodies there for you. Of course, on November the 3rd, I have the second of the long lunch clubs going on. That's a Wednesday lunch. I'm going to be focusing on some interesting things this time. Definitely going to have lots of peppers available. I'll show off lots of different ways to use radishes, parsley, and other delicious herbs and flowers. Now, I wanted to be sure and talk to you guys about some gardening tips. It's just Aislinn's South Texas planting guide and gardening tips. And one of the things after the last bit of rain that we just recently all got here on the coast, we are needing to weed and seed. So that means going through your gardens as quickly as you can and moving out the weeds and then going in and planting new seeds. Planting seeds for your root vegetables like your carrots and your radishes, any stalks like celery, things like broccoli, Brussels sprouts, any of the flowers you're trying to grow, and of course, any bulbs as well. And I promise I would give you October's It's Just Aislinn South Texas Planting Guide each week. And this week we're going to talk about October, what I'm sowing indoors. What does sowing indoors mean? Well, that's the things that I'm planting in the little starter pots with my seeds so that I can plant them over in my nurseries. And then later on, I will plant them out in my bigger gardens or in larger pots. Those are things like all of my herbs and flowers, chamomile, bachelor's button, hollyhock, lavender, calendula, pansy, snapdragon stalk, echinacea, lemon balm, sage, thyme, oregano, so many great things that you can be growing this time of year in your little indoor growing spaces. Stocking vegetables like celery, Swiss chard, asparagus, artichoke, and then of course those brassica vegetables. Those are our favorite this time of year. Broccoli, cauliflower, Brussels sprouts, cabbage, and kale. And that's really what I have for you guys this week. I am looking forward to having a fantastic week myself. I hope to see you guys out in the community. I wish you the best week ever, and I will see you soon.